As lawmakers in Washington debate police reform, the fight is heating up over changing Houston area law enforcement to make changes, including HPD. Channel 2 investigator Mario Diaz has the latest on what's being done to make the Houston Police Department more transparent. Transparency has been the topic of conversation nationwide of late, but here in Houston, it is focused in on the internal audit by HPD, an audit that has not been released to the public, and it was called in the aftermath of the deadly botched raid along Harding Street. I am reviewing that audit myself. The audit Mayor Sylvester Turner is referring to is an internal audit into HPD's narcotics division. Why are you hiding if you have nothing to hide. State Representative Gene Wu has been critical for the lack of transparency surrounding the audit. So has State Rep Garnett Coleman. Release the information. Several representatives have joined Wu in calling for the release of HPD's audit, as have several city council members. So with political pressure in Austin and at home growing, Mayor Turner told Channel 2 Investigates today the audit will be made available, but with a catch. And so I will say to Chief Acevedo and to HPD, with respect to that audit, we will make it available to our legislators. I respect the mayor, I support the mayor, um, but I'm disappointed in that. Otis Evagaru is the chief of staff of state rep John Rosenthal. He's also been critical of HPD not publicly releasing the internal audit. This is a public audit. The people paid for it. We have the responsibility to let the public know what is going on in these departments. So what about Chief Art Acevedo? Does he agree with the mayor? Yeah, absolutely. It was a very quick response, but Acevedo agrees by providing it only to legislators, even though the chief said this 15 months ago. So transparency, data, information belongs to the public. For now, Chief Acevedo says the public will be denied because of a legal ruling. We have a ruling from the AG we just re received that says for legislative purposes that we are required to release it to the legislature. A concern for the mayor is actually revealing some of the names of undercover narcotics officers inside of this audit. However, Evergaro and others have said those names can easily be redacted. At City Hall, Mario Diaz, KPRC, Channel 2 News. Mario.